Elephants, day two. Please take out your green science packet and open up to day two of elephants. We're going to begin learning about elephant habitats. A habitat is where an animal lives. Let's get started. Take out your pencil and write the fill in the blanks as they pop up. Elephants live in Africa and Asia. We have three fill-ins for that first sentence. I for live, in, I, N, and another I in the middle of the word Africa. Elephants live in Africa and Asia. So you'll hear a lot of times the terms African elephant or Asian elephant. When you hear those, that tells you where the elephant is from because they're a little bit different. They love their families and stay very close. All right, love, L-O-V-E, love. And an O for the middle sound in close. They love their families and stay very close. Herds of eight to 100 mother elephants and all the babies stick together and the oldest grandmother elephant leads them all. We have the word all, A-L-L, -L, and then oldest, O-L-D-E-S-T, oldest. So the families of elephants stay together, all of the mama elephants, with all of the babies and the oldest grandmother elephant is the leader of the herd. He decides when and where they move or rest. You can write an M for move and then the word rest, R-E-S-T, rest. Now that we've done all of the fill in the blanks, let's reread the paragraph and make sure that we've learned all that we can about elephants and their habitat. Go ahead and set your pencil down and put your finger underneath the word elephants. Track with your finger while I read aloud to you. Elephants live in Africa and Asia. They love their families and stay very close. Herds of eight to 100 mother elephants and all the babies stick together and the oldest grandmother elephant leads them all. She decides when and where they move or rest. Nice work. What was your favorite fact that you just learned about elephants and their habitat? I really enjoyed the fact about how all of the babies and moms stick together. And the oldest grandmother elephant leads them. I love that elephants stay with their family. So if I were drawing this picture, I would draw my favorite fact. I would draw a few baby elephants with some mama elephants and a grandma elephant leading them. Or maybe you liked that the grandma gets to decide where the elephants move or rest. So maybe you would draw the grandma elephant telling everyone to move or to rest. Whatever you decide, make sure you use lots of detail and you color your picture. Then go back to the lesson plans and watch the next three videos to learn more about elephants and their habitat. 